case briefs and so much more ls data's got what you're looking for in nuttle v reading company a 1956 case heard by the united states court of appeals for the third circuit a widow sued a railroad company after her husband's death she claimed the company had forced her husband to work while he was seriously ill violating the federal employers liability act and the boiler inspection act in the first trial, the jury awarded the widow $30,000, but the judge ordered a new trial due to emotional influences on the jury and other issues. During the second trial, the judge directed a verdict on the fella claim, and the jury found against the widow on the Boiler Inspection Act claim. Central to the dispute was the admissibility of evidence collected after the lawsuit was filed as part of a company investigation, which the court ultimately ruled inadmissible under the Federal Business Records Act. The widow argued that the statements should be allowed since the railroad had adopted them after the lawsuit was filed. Despite this, the court denied the widow's request to restore the first verdict and explained the reasons for the new trial order. Ultimately, the court reversed the judgment and remanded the case for a new trial due to the exclusion of crucial evidence, which led to an unfair trial. The case needed to be retried for a fair outcome to be achieved. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for Visit lse.law Elevate your mind Leave the stress of class